Mint Mobile has unlimited talk, text, and 12 gigabytes of high-speed data for $25 per month. Hey guys, today I thought I'd check out the Mint Mobile plans and features for October 2019. Actually, it's almost November already. I'm here on mintmobile.com. I'll have a link in the description below. All right, Mint Mobile is a prepaid wireless service. They use the T-Mobile network to deliver their service. So if you live in an area where T-Mobile has coverage, Mint Mobile might be a good choice for you. Now, before we get started, I want to say this is not a complete review. I'm just going to check out the plans and features to see what Mint Mobile has to offer. So the first thing we see here is they have plans as low as $15 per month. Now down here, one of the things I want to point out is that they say they have a seven day money back guarantee. So it's risk free. You can choose any of their plans. If you're not 100% satisfied, you can return it within seven days for a full refund. So that is a great offer that gives you the opportunity to sign up and try out Mint Mobile for seven days. And if it doesn't work out for you, you can get a refund. All right, let's check out the plans. Now, the first thing you need to understand about Mint Mobile is that normally prepaid wireless plans, you pay 30 days or one month in advance. But with Mint Mobile, you're going to pay for three, six or 12 months in advance. And in exchange for that, you're going to get a discounted price on your plans. Now, let's expand this and we'll check out all the plans. So you'll see they have three month, six month and 12 month plans. So the way this works is that the 12 month plans are the least expensive, followed by the six month plans and then finally the three month plans. So when you pay in advance, you get a better discount on your plan prices. And they have three different plans. Their most expensive plan comes with 12 gigabytes of high speed data per month. If you need more than 12 gigabytes of high speed data per month, then Mint Mobile is probably not a choice for you. They do not offer plans with more data than that. And they do not offer an unlimited plan. All right, let's start by checking out the plan I told you about in the intro. So that's unlimited talk and text with 12 gigabytes of high-speed data per month for $25. 12 months of service costs $300. Now, when you sign up, they'll send you the plan and a three-in-one SIM kit. So you'll always have the right size SIM for your phone. Now, if you look down here, they have a details section. This is very clear. Seven day money back guarantee, 12 months of service, 12 gigabytes of data per month. Now, once you use up that 12 gigabytes of high speed 4G LTE data, you're still going to have a data connection, but it's going to be at significantly reduced speeds. Unlimited talk, text, and data delivered on the nation's fastest, most advanced 4G LTE network. It's really the T-Mobile network. They just don't call it out by name here. Now, this plan is also going to include free international calls to Mexico and Canada. So that's from the United States to Mexico and Canada. Doesn't say anything about using your phone in Mexico or Canada. You can use this with a phone that you buy directly from Mint Mobile, or you can sign up for the bring your own phone BYOP plan. Two of the features that people are most interested in, these are features I spent a lot of time talking about because people are always asking me about them. First, mobile hotspot. You can turn your, your phone into a Wi-Fi hotspot for your laptop, tablet, or other Wi-Fi enabled device. So very desired feature. And then they have it listed here as Wi-Fi talk and text. And this is Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi calling. A lot of people want Wi-Fi calling. So with Wi-Fi calling, you'll be able to make calls and texts when you don't have full network coverage, as long as you have a Wi-Fi connection. So it's great to see that they offer those features. Now, one feature they didn't list here, but I hear from a lot of people that they want is visual voicemail. So if you have an iPhone, they support visual voicemail. You may need to go through the steps to make sure that you've updated your carrier settings to get visual voicemail working. And then it's also supported on certain Android phones. And then you can contact their customer care team if you need help figuring out whether or not your phone supports visual voicemail or getting it set up. All right, let's go back and check out the rest of the plan. So for the 12-month plans, they have a $15 a month plan with three gigabytes of 4G LTE data. So when you buy that, you're going to spend a total of $180. And they also have a $20 plan with eight gigabytes of 4G LTE data, and that's going to come out to $240 for the year. Now, if you don't want to pay for 12 months in advance, you also have the option to buy a six-month plan. You're going to pay a little bit higher price per month. The three gigabyte plan will be $20 a month. You're gonna spend a total of $120 for that. The eight gigabyte plan goes to $25 and you're gonna spend $150 for that for six months of service. And then finally, the 12 gigabyte plan goes to $35 per month or $210 for six months. And then finally, you have the option to buy three month plans. Now I wanna point out something here. The prices that they show at the top here 
are for an introductory offer. The actual price of the three-month plans are $25 per month for three gigabytes of data, $35 per month for the eight gigabytes of data, and then $45 per month for the 12 gigabytes of data. So for the three gigabyte plan with the three month option, you'd be spending a total of $75. For the eight gigabyte option, it would be a total of $105. And then on the 12 gigabyte plan, it would be a total of $135 for three months of service. Now that's the normal price, but for the first three months, you'd be paying $15 per month or a total of $45 for the three gigabyte plan, $20 for the eight gigabyte plan or total of $60 or $25 for the 12 gigabyte plan for a total of $75. So what they're doing is they're offering you an introductory offer where you're going to pay the same monthly price that you normally would pay on the 12 month plans. But this is only for the first three months. So if you were to sign up for this for the first three months, you'd pay a total of $45 or $15 a month, and then the price would go up to $25 per month. Now, I actually think this is a pretty interesting deal the way they have this set up. So they're giving you a lower price for prepaying for service in advance. Is this a good idea? Well, it really depends. You have to ask yourself, what service are you using now and how often do you switch providers? Have you switched in the last three, six, or 12 months? So they've done a pretty good job of eliminating the risk. First, they offer you the seven-day money-back guarantee. So you can sign up, try out the service, see if it works for you. If you find out that the T-Mobile network doesn't have coverage or there's something about the service you don't like, within seven days you can get a refund. Next, if you're going to sign up, you could start by signing up for the three-month plan. So you're going to make a 90-day commitment. And they're going to give you the same price per month as what customers using the 12-month plan pay. So you can sign up for any of these plans, pay $45, $60, or $75 for three months of service and try it out. If it turns out that Mint Mobile works out for you, you can continue to pay for the three-month plans. Or you could switch to the six-month or 12-month plans for additional savings. Let's check out the phones they have to offer. So you have a choice. You can buy a new phone or bring your own. So the first thing I notice here is they have a really good selection of iPhones. They have all the latest iPhone models. And they also have all the latest Samsung Galaxy models. So you'll see they have the S10 Plus, the Note 10 Plus. And they even have the brand new Pixel 4 XL and Google Pixel 4. Now the phone prices are not discounted. You're going to pay full price for these phones. However, they are including three months of service free with your phone. So let's check out the iPhone 11 here. So $749 for 128 gigabytes of storage. So that's the list price of the phone, but they are gonna give you three months of service on the eight gigabyte plan. So you are getting some savings there. Now, one thing I like about the way Mint Mobile has this set up is that they have the phone available in all the different color options, and they offer all the different storage options. So if you want to try and get the 64 gigabyte model, you could, or you could get the 256 gigabytes of storage. Now, it looks like the 64 gigabyte storage model is out of stock at this time, but they do offer different storage configurations. So that's nice to see. What else can I tell you about Mint Mobile? One of the things I noticed is that if you go to their help section, they have a very extensive FAQ or frequently asked questions section, and that's broken down by getting started, managing your Mint account, plans and service, using your services, and troubleshooting. You can come here and find answers to the different questions you have. So let's see. Let's just take a quick look at some of the questions they have here. So let's look at plans and services. So one of the questions I always have is, what happens if you use up your high-speed data? Can you add more to your plan in a, a given month? Can you buy add-on data? So scroll down through here. So you'll see I've finished my 4G LTE data before the end of the cycle. Can I buy more? And the answer is yes. You can either text up data to 6700 or log into your Mint Mobile account and add more data. Now, unfortunately, they don't tell you what the price of that extra data is. I think somewhere else on here, I saw that they offer two different options, one gigabyte of data and three gigabytes of data. If you're interested in finding out about their add-on data, you could check with their customer support team. I'm sure they could answer questions for you about that. So I'm pretty impressed with mintmobile.com here. I think the plan prices are very affordable. If you need a plan with 12 gigabytes of high-speed data or less per month, and you live in an area where the T-Mobile network has adequate coverage, Mint Mobile could be a choice for you. 
They seem to offer all the features that I would be interested in more. And one of the things I really liked was that FAQ section that explains the details of what they provide. So many times I hear from people, they tell me I signed up for prepaid wireless. I wasn't aware of what was included with the plan or what wasn't, but Mint Mobile makes that really clear. All right, what about you guys? Is anybody out there using Mint Mobile? Would you consider it? Hit me up in the comments and let me know. That's going to be it for this video, and I will talk to you next time.